Good afternoon. Happy New Year's Day to you. I'm Storm Surge 7 meteorologist Brian James. Want to update you weather-wise on what's going on right now, what's going to happen for tonight and during the day tomorrow as well. Not much going on for the first day of the new year. It is a little cold out there, but temperatures will drop down into the teens tonight and then back into the 30s tomorrow. But I want to show you the visible satellite. Something interesting here is the distinction between where there's snow and where there's a little bit of cloud cover. We do have some clouds, scattered clouds we've had around, it, especially across the central part of the Texas Panhandle. Uh, back toward the northwest, all of these areas you see that aren't moving, all the shading of white, that's all snow across northwestern parts of the Texas Panhandle, across most of the Oklahoma Panhandle and the eastern New Mexico. The southern edge of the snow is pretty much uh, this blue line that I'm drawing right here, goes up into northwestern parts of uh, uh, Oklahoma, then up into Kansas, and then across parts of Colorado, and then comes back down into northern parts of New Mexico. But this is all snow up here, and it's going to take a little while to melt. And with that melting snow, we also get a little bit of low-level moisture hanging around close to the ground with cold temperatures tonight, and that likely means that we'll have some low clouds still hanging around through the morning hours tomorrow. But uh, we are looking for a cold night tonight, but through the afternoon tomorrow, a wind shift line is going to move through, but temperatures will actually be warmer with more sunshine coming up. So for tonight, temperatures down in the teens for the most part, a few spots down around 10 degrees back toward the northwest with a mostly clear to part the cloudy skies, some of those scattered clouds forming for tonight. And then for the day tomorrow, high temperatures will top out in a mix of 30s to near 40 degrees, a good amount of sunshine. There might be a few high clouds around here and there, but thankfully the wind will be light. But we do start a warming trend starting tomorrow, and then we continue as we head toward the end of the week. It looks like back to seasonal temperatures by the end of this upcoming week. We'll have the seven-day forecast for you on Pro News 7 at 5, 6, and 10. We don't have any football games on ABC, so we'll have our regular newscast coming up for the rest of the afternoon and evening. Hope you're having a great New Year's Day, and we'll see you later on.